Hello and welcome to Total War Rome 2. I'm Wild Bill from Wild Bird Games and let's get started. So this is an online battle that I've done uh 1v1 uh with a with the against a random player is Malus is his name and we, he came to the battle with Massalia and I came with Macedon. Uh so let's take a look at the army comps here. I got a row of three archers here. We've got a row line of thorax swordsmen up front. I got two shield bearers in the back with one line of hoplites on the side to support my cav on the right. I got cav on the left. I got two Thessalian cav uh, along with two companion cavalry, Aspis companion cavalry on the on the left there. Uh, and two more Aspis, well one Aspis on the left uh, or on the right. Another citizen cav over there. And I have a Thessalian cav along with them. So we're basically moving up our armies right now. I'm going to slow it down just a bit to kind of go through his army as well. He's got Massalian, unit of Massalian cav, two Apeus lancers on the left. He's got another Massalian cav and the same, yeah, the same lineup on the right. Uh, he has two Thorax swordsmen to back them up. Same thing on the left. And he's got a line of hoplites in the front with his general in the center, which was interesting to me, but, you know, to each their own strategy, I suppose. So I'm going to move up. I'm moving up my archers right now to kind of use them as, kind of use them as bait, kind of, at least to draw their, draw their fire away from my infantry. And now I'm going to warn, warn the viewers here, my, my micro in Total War, I've, I've been playing for a while. I've I've been playing since uh, Medieval 2 came out, but my micro has just never it's just never been good. Even with all with all the time that I've played Total War and um it's just never my micro has never been good. So So we're having a so we're skirmishing right now. My archers, one of my archers is already routing because they're just destroying them right now. Completely destroying those archer units and they've just shattered. So he have drawn his cab out, which is kind of actually what I wanted. Kind of actually what I wanted in the first place so I could send in my spears after after them. I'm kind of having my thorax swords hold in, uh, in shield wall for right now. And I got his cab pinned down right there right now with my spears on the left. On the left I've been able to kind of turn around or kind of turn his flank on the on my left over here. And charging in my cab over here. Helping to take them out. On my right, however, kinda of having a bit a little bit more difficulty, although able to route his Hippaeus Lancers here. Well, almost. Um, he's sending in Thorax swords for support. I've decided to move up my infantry here in order to uh, engage his infantry line, which the Thorax swords would be should definitely be good against uh, uh, hoplites here. Let's get a close up on this charge here. Get a good look at this. Oh yeah, it's gonna be good. Oh yeah. Try and get as many close-ups as possible there. Now, <clears throat> all right. Well, we're turning around his. Uh, things are going well on my left flank over here. I'm not doing anything with these shield bears here. Like I told you, my micro is not that good. I've kind of left these shield bears doing nothing there for a second. Uh, I sent in my. He sent in his. Hippias lancers to kind of get into the back of my thorax swords, but I decided to use my general to kind of. He's a companion cav to kind of relieve them uh, of that rear charge there. I was able to kind of get my cav out of this engagement over here because I wanted to get them around to the back. And kind of now I'm going to send these guys around and kind of take out their archers over here, which, uh, which is much needed at that point. So finally I get around to using these shield bears and I get in the back of these uh, 
Massalian hoplites. And like I said, I use my cav to kind of get around to the back and get these, take care of these archers because they're kind of, they're doing some damage. They're being kind of annoying. Uh, he also, he gets another rear charge over here, but I do the same thing again with my general and I kind of, I rear charge him again. Uh, he's got some hoplites to kind of back up his, uh, his line over here. Let's see, we still got, my shield bearers are really kind of tanking out these, uh, these thorax swords here who are I mean these shield bears are I mean winning against these uh, thorax swords so let's see here it's kind of these shield bears too winning against against multiple units at the moment it's probably not well won't last for long but I finally get a rear charge on these hoplites here some more uh, close in shots here a little more cinematic Hoplites are not having a good time back here. I'm getting some missile shots in the back of us there, you can see. My thorax swords start to rout a little bit here. Yeah, his archers are still around over there. But that's fine. He's got his men in the back over there. <laughs> I'm sending, I send my hoplites off to those thorax swords are trying to, trying to get away over there. He sends, looks like he's sending his Hippias lancers around to the back, kind of try and take out these hoplites from behind. My general's really doing, getting a lot of, kind of helping out, out here with these rear charges over here. He thinks, I guess he thought charging his archers might be a good idea, but that, that would not end up well for him. Alright, I get my, yeah, I get my general around here. He's my only cav unit left, so I get him around the back to get some rear charges in. Get a really good charge into those, uh, thorax swords. I don't ever really, I don't withdraw my companion cam soon enough here, but it's fine because he's uh, he's wavering now and, and they just shattered, so that's good. I'm engaged his general, engaged with his general here in the back, or kind of in the center over here. I'm trying to take him out. Which I think I, event I eventually do here pretty soon. And I get a rear charge, let's watch this rear charge right here. Well, that wasn't very. <laughs> that was very anticlimactic. My unit is losing that engagement. We're kind of losing on the right here. The left, we're kind of, we're sort of keeping intact over here. But uh, oh, and this Aspis cab here. Uh, Makes it out with just one unit. He's still wavering, but he hasn't broken yet. He's just he's just the one guy. <laughs> Let's see here. Yep, I'm gonna use my cav here for another rear charge. I believe. Let's see here. I'm well, I'm moving him around a whole lot. Don't know what's going on with that. And my shield bears once again. My lack of of ability in, in micro here. I do nothing on my shield bearers over here. And I just let this charge happen. Where's my general? Here's my general. Alright. Alright, here's the charge. Let's see. This is probably going to be better. <laughs> oh yeah, this is going to be good. Decent charge. Not the best. I mean, there's not many units in the, in the cav unit there, so you can't really do too much. But it caused them to cause that unit to rout so that's good that's good I think we we killed a general at some point I think forget if it's here or not but let's see what happens oh we no no we route the general that's right because he's starting to route here wavering 
He'll break eventually, I think. Yep, my shield bearer... Not really doing too well, but he's in hoplite wall, so he's kind of... He's still steady, though. Well, now he's shaking. They, that's, that unit, the shield bearers are just beastly. They can, they can take a lot. Here's another rear charge. Oh, yeah, that was, that was good stuff. That was a good bear. That was a good rear charge right there. And we're, we're now ganging up on this one hoplite unit over here. He's, he's losing. <coughs> I forget when I finally realized that <laughs> that he's kind of out here and he's not uh, he's not routing or anything. He's just kind of sitting there. And now this becomes an issue over here. They just they just freed up all of this infantry over here because they I think yeah they routed my my shield bear. They all right yeah this this engagement broke up over here. We're we're forming battle lines over here and seeing what happens. My general's in the back over there. He's still alive, I think. Forming the lines up over here. <clears throat> See who makes the first move here. quite the standoff. He's trying to flank around here. It's not looking good for me. That's for sure. He's making the first move though because he's got the he's got the manpower. However, my units have the have the stamina. Their, their units are tired whereas mine are Mine are still fresh. I kind of turn my units around to try and try and get some flanking maneuver going. Trying to bring my general around, get some rear charges on them, see what we can do. This one, this unit starts breaking these Massalian hoplites are over here. I see that, and then I try and take advantage of that with my general. Oh yeah. <clears throat> he starts wavering again. Still wait. Yep. <clears throat> there he shatters. Sorry about that. Clear my throat here. Yep. Bring my general around again. Trying to get some more rear charges on him. <clears throat> Just doing anything I can to salvage this battle because it's not looking too good. Oh yeah, his unit's not in formation there. No bueno for him. And my Aspis Cav, my one unit of Aspis Cav here. <laughs> Trying to do something over here. Oh yeah, got one guy. <laughs> he's going down. He's going down fighting. That's, that's what he's... Oh yeah. And we got, no, yeah, he's, he's trying to combat that. Yep, my guy just shattered. He's, he's like, nah, nah, I'm out. <laughs> he's like, it's been fun, guys. <laughs> yep, so I move, yeah, it's that thorax sword, and I kind of force them to, they try and turn around to try and meet my companion cab, but I try, my thorax sword is free, so I, so I try and use them. Oh, yeah, and I deliver the final blow here on these guys who are, who are wavering they just shatter and then all of a sudden this battle this battle looks a lot better <laughs> oh yeah now that thorax sword is wavering my guys are still fresh I don't I honestly have no idea how they've just been fighting all along and they're still fresh and suddenly he's outnumbered Oh yeah, he's going in a hoplite now, but it's over. He's wavering now. I 
think I get one last rear charge from the general over here, maybe. Or he'll just... Or maybe he shattered before that. Oh, yeah. One last rear charge. Gotta watch this one. Oh, yeah. That was, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good one. And that was the end of the battle right there. So... A very very close battle to the end it was very exciting uh, congratulations to um, I mean Ismailis I mean he definitely put up a very good fight um, and it was a lot of fun but thanks for watching the battle guys and hopefully I'll have another one up pretty soon here and I'll see you next time uh, if you like the video please leave a like and comment and uh, subscribe if you liked all the rest of that and all of our other content as well and, uh, yeah, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you again next time.